LSU has taken that big win. It's time to think pro and get ready for the Super Bowl. So if you're thinking of catching the game at a fun spot and not having to clean up afterwards, we've got the place for you. We've got Sherry and Bobby from downtown Shreveport's new sports location, Anthony's Sports Bar. Guys, welcome to the show. You've got nachos. You've got thank some you. drinks. I'm excited to have you guys. Welcome. Yes, thank you. We're um, the new spot in Shreveport. We've been open what, since November 11th, mm -hmm. and um, we're trying to accommodate the downtown area. Uh, we're trying to bring some new and exciting things here in Shreveport. Yeah, absolutely. So we absolutely have, absolutely have things from club sandwiches, nachos, wings, any bar food you can think you have. Game day food for sure, we right? We got it all, we got it all. <laughs> yes. yes, definitely. So let's get started. We were going to make some nachos today. So yes. tell them how you make them at Anthony's. Okay, we we ground fresh brown ground beef mm -hmm. here every day, every day. Uh, this is homemade Velveeta cheese okay. here. Do your meat and... And who doesn't love notches for game day, right? I know, I know. You see, and you can also see, we, we're not we're not skimpy with the meat. <laughs> no, with the meat. you're going to get plenty of meat on those mm -hmm. nachos. Mm -hmm. And the best part is, is that you don't have to clean up after yourself. You oh, can just go no. to Anthony's. Sherry, tell me a little bit about the atmosphere there at Anthony's. It's definitely the place to go to watch the game. You guys have live entertainment. You have we, a DJ. Yes, and also, you know, we, we book private parties. We do um, catering mm -hmm. also. Um, mostly... Mostly we do, we, we support all our local teams. We try to invite them out to have their game days. You know, like, for instance, like the 49ers. Yeah. Oh, on, <laughs> on Sundays and Saturdays. They're the spot to be. I, 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 I'm a, a cowboy fan. Yeah. I'm a cowboy fan. But, uh. <laughs> but you got to go watch the game there. Bobby, we have not forgotten about you. Don't worry, my friend. Sherry, we're going to let you finish okay, those nachos. Okay, and then okay. we've got a drink to me. You got Anthony's Hurricane, I believe, right? Right. It's a signature drink I made for uh, just grab a lot of people's attention. It's real okay. colorful. So we just kind of mix it up for you guys so you get a little bit what it looks like yeah so what are you putting in there uh there's blue caruso mm -hmm. all right and we're gonna use some ice here to try to add a little color it's all about making it fun right with those oh, colors yeah. in there of course of course <laughs> apologize about the mix that's okay we don't mind when we were making drinks in the kitchen. You can get the ice everywhere. We're uh, totally okay with that. Well, I mean, you know, you normally know get a lot of ice behind the bar, too. So, that's saying, I'm so the only true. one that be back there. So, <laughs> that's about it. So, we're going to put in here, I mixed in some orange juice and pineapple. Okay. All right. Give it a little color. Orange juice and pineapple. Mm-hmm. All right. Ooh. And then to give it a little flavor, we want to give it some rum. A and little rum. Use. Let me move this out of the way so we can see and a little all tequila. of that goodness. That's right. A little tequila. Just a little tequila. Right. Not much. I'm going to put some uh, lemon lime on here. Also, I have uh, a cherry or two. And then I'm going to add a little flavor on the top with grenadine. And one of the reasons why we call it a hurricane, when you mix it up together, it makes like a fun little color down at the bottom. And it'll oh, start to change so colors. Yeah. I love the blue at the very bottom. I'm sure that tastes delicious. We're going to try it after the show. But I want to talk about how nicely this pairs up, that delicious drink with these nachos, Sherry. That's right. You know, everybody normally gets tacos and margaritas. Yeah. <laughs> We're doing touchdown nachos and hurricanes. And it, <laughs> and it looks so good. We're about to have some nachos. We're going to have Josh come back over here and give us one more look at our weather. And then we're going to have some nachos, yeah? Okay. Thank you guys for being with us today. We're so excited to have you guys. Thank Josh, you. Josh, what's going on? Yeah, it should be a good weekend actually to be inside because we have a little rain on Saturday and then on Sunday it'll be a little bit cooler. So outdoor plans look a little better on Sunday. Obviously, we have the football games this weekend, so I think a lot of people will probably be inside watching those. But enjoy the warmer weather that we'll have this week. Again, we'll have on and off rain for the next few days, and eventually the rain comes to an end this weekend. Next week's looking cold, it's looking drier, but it looks like we'll be back to regularly scheduled January with temperatures in the 50s. For much of next week. Nachos are my favorite. Oh, get in here, Josh. Guys, thank you so much. Don't forget Anthony's Sports Bar is located in downtown. It's a spot to be if you want to watch the game, have some delicious food and some drinks. Guys, thank you again for being with us today. Okay, thank yeah. you. Yeah. Guys, thanks for hanging out with us right here. I love you. We'll be looking forward to you tomorrow. Have a happy Tuesday.